gonna use stick control, controlling with the stick. It can be a wooden stick, it can be even just a broken piece of broom, okay? The idea is to use this one as a control instrument. Let's start from the same side arm. We did the same exercise before using our wrist or our arm. Now we're gonna use our stick. I wanna be sure that I always go towards the wrist, okay? And from here, I need to create 100 degree rotation. And use my elbow, I guess, his back. Now, I don't want to hurt him too much, you know, he needs to be kind of lean, but to, by this point, I need to make it realistic. So I'm trying to, from here, I transition the handle on my stick from this position, like I'm kind of using a shovel, shoveling up. So I can hide behind, of course, I can also control it. If I want it to go all the way, I can put this around this neck and grab it and choke it. Okay? Slow motion. Yeah. Yeah. My goal is not to hurt him. You, know, you need to be kind of flexible. Stuff can hurt you. So one, choke it. At the same time, one, rotating. Control, change, handle, bring him up. Okay? Now let's do opposite arm. I'm pre-positioning myself a little bit away from this other hand. I'm not gonna be here, I'm gonna be kind of here. So now I'm going to step in, up. I don't wanna have all the way, up. Immediately, move his arm. Bring it close to me, control it. Now bring this down against me and put pressure, it hurts. Okay, slow motion I do it here. So the idea now with your partner, you want to learn the movements, you don't want to hurt them because this stuff after three minutes, you say, I'm not going to do this anymore. So try to do slowly, learn the movement slowly, and then eventually once in a while, you can put a little bit more realism, but always no more than 20%, okay? So I'm coming here, in. This one, in. Control, up, push down, push. So, repositioning myself, stepping in, move the arm, control, bringing them up, move them around. Okay. Remember, it's very important when we're here to move his hand here. And here, this is going to be the grip so you can see the details. And lift this up, push this down. You want to push this hand down. This is the pressure going to be here on this part of the forearm and then push them out. 